Okay, it looks like the cops been getting in on some of King's protection rackets. Now that's why they've been going so easy on the VKs. We gotta go public with this shit. Now if we- Don't worry, Dex. I have something more subtle in mind. Johnny, you can't be serious. Fuck yeah, I am. Where did you get those? Anthony's condo. He had a big mouth. This isn't gonna end well. Don't listen to the old woman. I'll drive to where the cops are picking up protection money. You make them cease and desist with one of Tony's noisemakers. If we make sure the only cops we hit are the ones working for King, people gonna start asking questions, and the cops are gonna have no choice but to come down on the VKs to save face. Let's do this. So the other day, Aisha's giving me shit because I don't do anything nice for her. Can you believe that? I mean, I pay for her every time we go out. So I'm like, what the hell are you talking about? I picked up the check at the firing range. And she goes on and on, dinner this, flowers that. It's fucking bullshit, right? Yeah, thanks for your advice, man. You're a big help. Okay, we're coming up on one of the meetings. Sure, you know how to handle that thing. Right away, my ass. Get that bad boy ready. There's a meet up ahead. Time to say hello to Stillwater's finest. Man, we should do this every week. Hey, next time, I call dibs on the RPG. Let's take care of these guys next. Payoff is going down up ahead. What do you say we crash their little meter? That was fucking sweet! You ready to send a message to Monroe and King? This day just keeps getting better and better. Nice shot, man! But that takes care of the cops. Let's stop by Forgive and Forget before we give our last little present to the Vice Kings. I think the kings are through with the policemen's balls. Now all we got left to do is give Warren a nice final fuck you, and I'd say this has been a hell of a day. Hello? Hey, it's good to hear from... What? Wait, wait, slow down. What are you saying? 
Look, our arrangement has been beneficial for both parties. Look, why don't we talk about this tonight over dinner? I'm sure we can work this out, okay? All right. See you tonight. Goodbye. See? This is what I'm talking about. Who said you could come in here? We need to talk. Do we now? You've been putting yourself before the crew. Keep talking, little nigga. If you hadn't wasted our time sticking your nose up them white boys' asses, we could have owned the whole damn game by now. I told you before, we ain't getting into that shit. And why the fuck not? That's where the money is. Man, if you got done with that shit back in the day, the Carnales would have been ghosts right now. But you didn't, did you? You were too much of a pussy then. And you're too much of a pussy now. Ah! You forgot who you talking to. My name is Benjamin motherfucking King. I'm the man who took my crew from being a bunch of baby gangsters in Sunnyvale to being one of the most influential and feared forces in the goddamn city. You know how I did that? I said you know how I did how, that? Mr. King? I did it by knowing when it was time to build, when it was time to watch, and when it was time to act. I'm through carrying your punk ass. If I were you, I'd drop them damn flags and get the fuck out of here before I erase your ass. I ain't going nowhere. You ain't hearing me, son. I said... Yo, fuck that. You ain't hearing me. What is this? I built, I watched, and now I'm acting. 